I'm in Colombia, last day, tomorrow I'm gonna cross into Ecuador, it's 100 kilometers away. Just Google the places in Ecuador and uh, there's a lot of mountains there. So it's gonna be cold, dry and the weather shows rains, only rains. Just a bit of summer somewhere in the morning, like a few hours, not even summer, partially cloudy. Oh man, I swear, since I crossed into Guatemala, I'm like chasing the sun and getting up in the mountains with such a weather. In the tropics, it was still okay, you know, you get wet, you keep driving, you get dry. You keep driving, you get wet, and then you get dry. Or even though you got wet, it's not cold, you can drive. I was driving at night, you know, and I can still drive. In high altitude, it's not really possible because as you drive, your gloves become wet, just things that fingers get numb, you don't feel them. And uh, then Of course, because I don't have a windshield, I just Googles, Googles. I don't have part protected here, so water comes here, and then it comes to the neck, and then gets wet here. More crew, more important part, man. The real, true source of warmth is that if that part gets wet, it means you're 90% wet away. So I'm giving myself another 30 days to finish this trip. It's okay. Even with the gear daring get crossing, I kind of within the limits of my 20 days expenses. Because I didn't spend much on the bike, because I was not driving a lot. Fuel, shillings, so so. I spent like maybe six to seventy dollars for necessary stuff, which is cigarettes and beers. I guess no, I start smoke more often now because I have more free time. Nothing to do, just trying to manage stress. By smoking, I know it's stupid, but it kind of works. I want to stick to one cigarette per day, the other day. Let's see. And uh, yeah, let's see.